Hello. So this vlog is about me leaving my home and going to my college that is in LU Delhi for the very first time. So we were taking a train because obviously I had a lot of stuff that needed to be carried and it was just a night's journey to Delhi. Here's my mom making a very funny crying face. I guess my parents were somewhere probably relieved that finally ghar se ja rahi hai ghar mein hangama kam hoga there won't be any menace in the house. But yeah so see we had a lot of stuff that we were carrying with us. Honestly at this point of time I was just so excited by the train journey itself because I was traveling by a train after a very long time. And you'd be surprised to know that this is Lucknow that we're crossing, and we were very close to where I used to live in Lucknow. And you know, when my father was tucking me in for the night, the only thing I could think of was that finally tomorrow I'm going to wake up in Delhi. And I'm a sucker for Delhi, honestly. It's one of my very favorite cities. And when I woke up in the morning, we had already reached. We were at the New Delhi railway station. and the weather was cloudy and thoda thanda thanda and it was very very nice so then we had to go to my bhaiya's place uh, somewhere near noida gaziabad border and here's the thing about delhi so if you're visiting or coming to delhi after a very long time once you are here you know that you are in the capital of your country like everywhere you will just see headquarters ring central offices like it's you just know that you are in delhi and i was just looking outside the window in awe of it all Well, I'm in Delhi, and uh, we've reached here a bit in just in the morning, and uh, I'm very excited because uh, I'm just uh, I'm just going to get ready. I'm just wearing what I was wearing in the train, and I'm really really excited uh, to go to go to college because I have been waiting for it since so long, and finally it's happening. So I'm very happy. I'm very excited. Started working. I slept at three tonight, <laughs> and I again woke up at six today. So, mm. so you can imagine. Yeah. In what happy zone? In what I'm mood in. you are <laughs> right now? But then I'm very happy for you. <laughs> Obviously. Is all is all that I can say, and I'm very excited that you're in Delhi. Yes. Finally. Yes. I'm just going to go like this. Amma has a little red sun, kumbh sun, and I'm ready. And I'm very, very excited, obviously, because oh, I have been wanting to go to this college since such a long time. I had been manifesting it, bohot zada, and finally today I'm going to be at that place. So I'm really excited, and I feel very happy. I feel very happy in this pink. I don't know why. So I'm very uh, happy right now. I'm very excited. Let's see how it turns out to be. So we were taking a metro to the college, and we boarded the metro at Noida Electronic City Station, which is one end of the blue line, and had to go to Dwarka Sector 14, which is almost the other end of the blue line. So it was a quite long metro ride. If you're coming to NLU Delhi, carefully look at these stations. These are the stations that you'll always have to take metro to. And near the normal Delhi metro rush was there. I was actually holding on to my dad's shirt to not get lost or left behind. After finally finding a seat, we settled down. And honestly, when the metro started, that is when I actually felt a jolt ki i'm going to nlu delhi i'm going to be there at nlu dika campus abhi tak i was all delhi 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 ye ye i'm in delhi but that is when it hit me that oh my god i'm going to go to college now finally and it's a big feeling it's a huge feeling you're a grown up now so we deboarded at dwarka sector 14 station and i was just thinking that I'm just two minutes, three minutes away from the campus. Oh 
वैसे तो देर वॉज नो नीड टू टेक एन ई रिक्शा द बैक गेट ऑफ द कॉलेज फ्रॉम अ वॉकिंग डिस्टेंस टू द मेट्रो स्टेशन बट स्टिल इट फेल नाइस टू ड्राइव पैरल टू द कैंपस विद माई पेरेंट्स देर सिटिंग इन दी रिक्शा इट वॉज वेरी नाइस एंड देर वी आर एट द प्लेस वी हैड बीन ड्रीमिंग टू बी एट it feels to be here it's like going into one of your dreams one of your fantasies it's like seeing your hard work in a form of physical manifestation it's like knowing that you have made yourself and your parents proud it's like knowing that you know you are going to make a life for yourself that you had always wanted to so it's overall a very overwhelming feeling you feel weird because you know that this is going to be your new home whoever and however much they say you have left your old home behind and this is going to be Here we are at the NLU Delhi Auditorium. So basically, we were there for the first day to get our documents verified and to complete our admissions. Basically, so each of the student is given a file with their name on it and then you have they have already put in all your documents that you had submitted during the counseling process and you have to fill in the forms you have to fill in your details and everything so that is exactly what we were doing here this is the chota sa model that you'll find in the auditorium of the entire campus of nlu delhi ओके आई बी वेरी ऑनेस्ट यूर ओके सो फर्स्ट डे बिल्कुल समझ ही नहीं आ रहा था कि कैंपस में कहा क्या हो रहा है ऑल राइट इट वॉज वेरी कन्फ्यूजिंग इट इट्स अ वेरी स्मॉल कैंपस बट इट्स काइंड ऑफ सर्क्यूलर सो इट्स पजलिंग कि वे वे गोइंग एंड वे वे सपोज टू गो सो इट वॉज काइंड ऑफ रियली कन्फ्यूजिंग फॉर मी एंड फॉर एवरीबडी एल्स आई गेस इज वेल so here is a very weird statement that i'm going to make but the hostels here are good okay they're not bad as the hostels of other places apparently but the hostels were good and in my first visit i really liked the hostels and in delhi is amazing okay i just <clears throat> i'm just loving it here in the campus it's green it's 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 small it's like a society it's like some colony that you live in and it's very nice i'm just liking it a lot so this as you guys have already seen is the girls hostel ka gym These are all the equipments that there are. और ये मम्मा मैम के साथ सेटिंग करते हुए कि देखना मेरी बच्ची को कोई दिक्कत ना हो या अगर वो कोई दिक्कत करे तो मुझे जरूर बताइएगा एंड 
This, my lordships, is GH ka mess. And then we were being taken to show the rooms and the wings, except where we would be staying. This is actually a hostel wing, and these are our rooms. As you would already know, in LU Delhi has trimester. No, sorry, not trimester. Tri seater rooms. So when you come, you basically get a bed, a table, a chair, and cupboards. That's all. And if you go thoda saw inside, you come to the third part of the room where the third person lives, or first person, second person, whatever number you want to give to your roommates. <laughs> This is the common room which only girls hostel has. Boys hostel may luxury nahi hai, and it's a pretty useful place. I've made a lot of videos over there. So after the document verification process my parents and I we had lunch in the cafeteria and my father is still a fan of that one lunch that he had at the cafeteria I don't know what he liked in that but yeah he is like yeah that was a good food and I was just roaming around the campus making very weird faces and it was drizzling and after that we were made to sit in the academic block inside the moot court hall and uh, we had to meet the vice chancellor with our parents so the wait was quite long and a lot of parents were waiting to meet the vc and people were growing very restless but i was all happy vlogging <laughs> i was just so happy i was recording every single thing little thing that i could record and yeah that was pretty much it that is what we did in the first day that i spent on the campus my first impression of the campus was absolute gorgeousness and that's all that's all So I hope you liked the video. I hope you enjoyed it. This is the first time that I had vlogged in my entire life. Do like and share the video. Please subscribe to my channel. I'll keep making content on law school and my personal life as well. So I hope you liked it. Take care. Bye bye.